burning me up without a doubt. I'm torn from the inside out. I don't know which way is right and which way is wrong. All I know is so much is going on, so much around this world, so much pain, so much hate, discrimination, racism, sexism, everything, right there on one big, giant hatred plate. It's irritating, man. It's frustrating as I don't know what. Everybody's heart is bursting, bursting with pain, agony, so much so that there's no fight left in me. Exhausted, our spirits are exhausted, running from here and there, trying to solve a problem that's centuries old. It's been around as long as the air we breathe. It's been around as long as humans been on this earth. Go back to Cain and Abel. Then go up to Joseph and his brothers. Hatred has been around for generation after generation. Hatred is what started racism. Hatred is what started discrimination. Hatred, hatred, and the fear. There it is. There it is, the fear. Hatred. Did you think that hatred could come from fear? It does. The fear of not being recognized, not being seen, not being enough, not being worthy. Fear. Fear can make you do things that you never thought you would. Can make you hate a person and then do nothing to you. Fear can make you hate somebody who you feel is looking right through you. Hatred. Fear turns into hatred. Fear turns into abuse. Fear turns into anger. Fear turns into lust. Fear turns into... All things that can create you to become empty, that's what fear is. You ask, where does the hate come from? Where does the racism come from? It's the same in both worlds, on both sides. Every color, every race, even inside of the races, there is discrimination within the race. Foolishness, foolishness, constant, I don't understand how in the world can we hate someone that is our own skin, color, same color as me, but yet your hair not straight enough, but your hair is nappy. You too black, well, you too light skin, you too close to white for me. Oh no, but you too black, you black as night, you black as tar, don't nobody want to be around that. Black. How dare you make my black seem ugly instead of beautiful? How dare you? Black, white, Hispanic, it don't matter. African, it don't matter. Wherever you from, whichever nation you came from, you are made by God. All of us people on this earth, we are made by God. We are children of God to represent God, to live here in peace under God. We were supposed to be not just one nation, one world under God. He created the world. He created us as people in this world. Whether you believe it or not, you didn't give your body breath. You didn't wake your brain up to think the next day. You wasn't even sure if you was going to make it to the next day. You just thought you would. Somebody didn't wake up today. Somebody didn't get out of bed today. Somebody crossed the street and got hit today. Somebody's life got taken today by a gun, by abuse, by drug addiction, by alcoholism. Many things can destroy us. It's not just racism. Something we need to think about. We need to get some clarity. Clearism. <laughs> I need to be a word one day. (laughs) But for real, y'all, it's something to think about. And all of us are at a time where we need to pray.